So there's a reason why I charge $350 an hour as a freelancer and why my clients are more than happy to pay for that. And this has to do with why I really do try to restrict my working hours. I'm an expert freelancer. I have been writing my entire life. And as a freelance writer, I've been really honing my copywriting skills. And I also really know how to get to the heart of what clients want fast and get them drafts that they're really happy with. In fact, most of my clients don't even request rewrites on a lot of my projects because they're so blown away by the first draft. They're like, cool, we're good to go. That's not to say that every single week is a four day, four hour work week. Some weeks I just, you know, a project comes up, something that I really wanna take on and I stretch that a little further, but I do try to kind of keep it close to that 16 hour per week. But like I said, it really just depends on the project. It depends on what I'm working on. Um, but yeah, I do believe that we have only so many hours of really great high quality concentrated work time. And if we push too far beyond that, we get diminishing returns and clients can tell. And that's why I really think it's important as a freelancer that you can get to a freelancing work week that is not too crazy. But yeah, if you have any questions about how to get to a four day work week, uh, give me a follow. I'll be posting more tips along here and let me know if you have any questions.